What's up guys? Welcome to the channel. Hope you're doing well. We are in my basement today and we are hunting for hidden gems. And I found one here with a series called Extremity. So stay tuned. <laughs> So what we have here is a futuristic sci-fi bloody revenge tale written and illustrated by Daniel Warren Johnson. I love the writing and art style here. I'm surprised how good this series is. It kind of feels like a mix between Rick Reminder's writing style and the art style kind of feels inspired by humanoid sci-fi books. In terms of spaceships and planets, at least that's the resemblance I'm seeing. So this is a sad, tragic, and unique story with very rich main characters. A tragic event occurs to this clan called the Roto, whose home planet gets invaded by a group of people called the Paznina. It focuses on a family whose lives have been ruined and altered, Every main character in this is very fleshed out and has a specific personality type that you can easily distinguish. We have a father, Jerome, who is hungry for revenge due to the death of his wife due to the invasion. His daughter, Thea, whose arm was cut off during this event, spoiling her artistic talent. Her brother, Rolo, who has a lot of doubt for his father's revenge path is fairly shy and befriends an android who turns out to be an awesome supporting character, as well as some other great supporting characters that bring their own unique style to this story. That being said, this story is mainly focused on revenge, war, and past fallen civilizations. Thea, our main character, is pretty interesting. She is a sad, tragic figure, after losing her mother and arm, limiting her ability to draw like she once did, but she does have some pretty cool arm attachments that can be used in combat, like an arm cannon and a hook. Like I said, this series really surprised me. It's overall a great story, and quite touching actually. Great world building, great characters, nice use of blood and gore. What more can you ask for? It's only a 12 issue series, the first arc is better than the second, but it all ties up right at the end. So if you're into the sci-fi genre at all, I think this is a good addition. Let me know what you think. If you end up picking this up, that is, I'm going to throw this video in the Hidden Gems playlist. So if you want to see more, check out that playlist. I'll link it at the end of this video. And until next time, guys, take care. Mm -hmm.